Well, today is Women's Equality Day, celebrating the importance of women's right to vote. And while this was the start for women gaining equal footing to men, there are still areas that need more work. One area specifically, health care equity. And our Tatiana Cash joining us live in studio to explain more. Jeff, that's right. Equality for all is key, but studies have shown that when it comes to health care equity, here in Northwest Ohio, it's lagging behind the nation in breast cancer diagnosis. I spoke with one survivor and the executive director of the Northwest Ohio Susan G. Coleman's Foundation about this issue, and it is a big one. Sometimes when I reread that, I just think, damn, I deserve some champagne. Janelle Hart has beaten cancer twice. Diagnosed with Hodgkin's lymphoma in 1994 and then breast cancer in 2013. Her journey, originally a blog, is now the Cancer Diaries. My friends and family wanted to know what was going on with me, but yet they didn't want to keep calling me and stuff. So I said, well, I'll start this thing. And then everybody said, you should turn it into a book. And that it was sort of fun for me, taking pictures and putting pictures in there. And Unfortunately, heart story is common in the U.S. Data shows one in eight women are diagnosed with breast cancer. But in Northwest Ohio, diagnoses are much smaller. One in only five, says Susan G. Komen Foundation Executive Director Gretchen Awad. Our Northwest Ohio community is very broad, very diverse, lots of health care options focused in the more urban areas and not necessarily the more rural areas. So that is where disparities come to play. This heart says women must put themselves first. You've got to take charge sometimes. And, and there's, to me, there's very little more important to take charge of than your own health. Equitable health care for men and women are different sometimes. And we have come a long, long way. Both women agree standing up for your health is important because access to health care may not always be close and doctors don't always know what's best. They, they told me I was crazy. Tom had to go to every doctor appointment with me after that. I saw 12 doctors, 12 different doctors. Even the great Cleveland Clinic couldn't diagnose me. Where you live should not determine if you live. It's never just a diagnosis. It's always a story. So how will you tell yours? You can support the mission to end breast cancer. The Susan G. Komen Race for the Cure is going to be on Sunday, September 25th. Money raised from that goes to research and patient support. For more information on the race, head to our website, WTOL.com. Live in studio, Tatiana Cash, WTOL 11.